Hey, what's up? Dusk the Viking here. Welcome back to a long forgotten You Solve It. But now we're on the Apocalypse update, so this will be You Solve It Apocalypse. We're going to be on Restricted Sunny Meadows. Two evidence will be given, one will not be given, so you'll have to deal with a little bit of behavior. I've got the activity monitors on so that you can keep track of that, and the sanity on so that you can keep track of that. And let's get started. Alright, uh, we'll get some tracking stuff out here. We'll locate the old ghost first. Which way does this door open? There we go. There we go. We got the quiet night. This is when the asylum is the creepiest. It's just dead quiet. Echoey. It will hopefully make it a little easier to find the ghost, but... And definitely creepier. This... May be a huge coincidence. But I am finding that the ambient audio on this new map seems to be more active near the ghost's room. Of course, there's more ambience in the basement, always. Here we go. It's definitely in here. And so what I, I mean here, like, the screams and stuff are coming from down here at the edge of the hall. Of course, we had some down there, but again. Okay. Probably just a coincidence. Looks like the breaker has already been flipped off. Well, let's see if we can get it to touch the light switch. Turn on the light. Close the door. That better be fake, okay. <laughs> wow, it's really... Really messing with stuff, isn't it? We give it a little bit more on the parabolic. I want to see if it talks again. Definitely did talk again. Let's go get some more stuff. Oh, hey, we got something. All right, let's check our boards here, see what this looks like. All right, what else are we going to get down there? Let's go ahead and get a book down there. Let's get a dots projector. Back down we go. Still in here messing with jars. Kind of in the back here, so let's put that there. We'll put that there. Let's watch the dots for just a second while we also hold up the parabolic again. I 
think it just touched this door, so let's give that a look. Keep in mind, only two evidence will be given. That means that if you don't see an evidence, it could still very well be a ghost that has that evidence. It just might not be giving that particular evidence since it's only going to give two. All right. There we go. I didn't... Get anything too crazy on that. Oh, wait, what? I didn't know you could pick that up. I was just trying to ring it. Alright, so there's our sanity. There's our activity. Let's go ahead and get a dots projector. And we'll take a spirit box down there. One of the trippy things about this map is that you do get locked into the wing that the ghost is in, so we will... <laughs> we will definitely want to try and make our way down this hallway. Well, you can hear it down here. It's messing with the jars. Where are you? Where are you? Wow. Wow. Well, unfortunately, it does not look like the, uh... Like, it did not seem like the voice recognition was working. Let's watch the camera. Here's our activity. There's our sanity. Camera four. Let's turn that on. We'll give this a good watch. See if anything happens watching. pretty dead we can go ahead and put a crucifix in the room I'm gonna put it toward the back of the room because it seems to be oriented more toward the back where are you where are you are you here are you old? I... Are you friendly? Where are you? I definitely saw the ghost fog fly through the air. Okay, activity sparking up a bit. This is working, kind of. Where are you? Are you old? Where are you? Are you friendly? One more thing before we go. The crucifix is burned up on one side, if you saw that.
Okay, so that was two hunts back to back. Ooh, I heard that whispering. I heard that whispering. <laughs> I was like, oh no. Oh no. Definitely got, uh... See upside down bell now. Definitely got a dangerous one on our hands, don't we? Yeah, there's the sanity. Holy moly. Well, this one is a little bit more complicated because the voice recognition was not working very well. But there's quite a bit of other evidence at play. So hopefully that's enough for you to figure this one out. I'll give you just a second here to go about your stuff. Pause the video if you need to think about it a little bit. And here we go. Let's see if you managed to guess the ghost correctly. Ghost type, the twins. Some of you might have caught that there at the end when we got a straight up double hunt with basically no grace period was probably the biggest tell that game. Anyway, hope you got it right. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next video.